Hey, what's up guys? It's Carl here, and today I have a new commentary. Not a lot of crazy stuff to talk about, but I do have one really big topic that I would like to share with you guys today. Okay, so the really big topic for today, a YouTuber named Sam Pepper in the UK, he uploads pranks, he uploads just, you know, YouTube videos. He has over 2.2 million subscribers, and you know, the main type of videos he does is like social experiments and pranks and stuff like that. So we uploaded this prank, and it was a killing my best friend prank. Basically, during this video, they faked a kidnapping and they faked a murder of like this guy's best friend. And they show they didn't tell him like right away. They killed, they fake killed his best friend. Let him sit there for like 30 seconds, just watching him cry and shit. And then they tell him, oh, it's just a prank, bro. You just went through that horrible thing, but you know it's just a prank. We didn't kill your best friend. And this guy, the person who got pranked, he's defending the person who pranked him. And people are still just harass, not harassing, but just constantly tweeting at Sam Pepper, go fuck yourself, kill yourself. Like what were you thinking, dude? This is such a horrible prank. This isn't even considered humor like this is terrible and even Sam is like saying oh it wasn't for humor It was supposed to show you that you know You're supposed to cherish life and you know really cherish your friends But people are just telling him dude you went way too far You should honestly just remove the video deactivate cancel your YouTube like dude people are going crazy over this prank It has over 90,000 dislikes and even with the person who got pranked defending him They're not stopping they really do think this prank has went too far and people want it removed people are surprised that you YouTube hasn't removed it yet. It's not like any of us know why he uploaded, but it's still pretty crazy that he uploaded a killing my best friend video for a prank. Like, I, I truly believe that he took it too far too. The next topic I have for you isn't that crazy, but Faye's reign in the past month has gained over 41 million total views between his Faye's reign channel and his Faye's reign vlog channel. The raindrops and the shit shats have accumulated over 41 million views in 30 days and over 300,000 new subscribers. Now, me being a subscriber of Rain since around 400,000 subscribers, seeing that he is gaining that many subscribers every single month, it's just absolutely insane, and I just can't even believe it. It's just pretty crazy to think that over 40 million total views is happening on his two channels every 30 days. Over 1 million total views every single day on the phase rain main channel like that is absolutely incredible congrats to the growth rain you deserve it my man now in other news cod youtuber red scarce is suing phase carl for stealing his news for the day red scarce is requiring phase carl to terminate his youtube channel and deactivate his twitter until he pays the 100 dollars fine and shows up to the court hearing scarce hasn't heard anything from carl yet but i'm pretty interested to see how this story turns out that's it for the news today guys make sure to leave a like if you did enjoy it I know it wasn't that much I know too much crazy stuff didn't happen but hopefully you did enjoy it anyway make sure to check out the two links on the screen that you see right now I double uploaded yesterday so be sure to check that out and uh, yeah guys peace I have no idea why I decided to be your news reporter for the day this was by no means trying to make fun of red scarce in any way it was all just you know trying to make you guys laugh I was just trying to you know entertain you a little bit I thought you guys would find it funny that face Carl was giving you your news for the day instead of scarce so yeah this was not an attempt to make fun of scarce in any way shape or form it was just for your enjoyment hopefully scarce doesn't sue me